Hi, it's Gerrit from Gerrit's Craft Room, and in this video, I'm going to make artist trading coins on a card this time. And I want to tell you about the new community tab at the top of the, my channel. And I will add some new and fun things there, like behind the scenes and polls and such. So you can go check that out if you like. So let's go on to the video. I cut circles out of watercolor paper and I spray some drops of water and then start adding some color. I use the Summer Holiday Nouveau Aquafo pen set and I dry in between with the heat tool. And then I add some more color and spray some more water drops. And I'm going to dry this again. This way you get gorgeous layers of the same color and the ink reacts to water so you can create some fun texture. By the way, I added the products I used in the description box for you. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. The sides with the yellow are still a bit wet, so I add some red there and get some pretty orange because the colors mix. I dry it again, I'm going to spray more water and dry again. I add some ink to the acrylic block and dip in the pen to make some splats by tapping on the pen. Then I'm going to spray some drops again, activating and diluting the greenish ink a bit. And I'm going to blot so the color isn't too intense. I cut some funky florals and I'm coloring them with the green pen. After drying, I spray some water drops to get the fun distress look. And they look a bit more real to me. And then I blot to get lighter spots. I added uh, little berries to a sticky note. And this way it's easier to color them. And it's maybe better to start with the yellow, but the brush cleans real easy by brushing it on a piece of paper or cloth. I let the berries dry and then assemble them. Just a bit of glue on the base and then put on the colored berries. And then it's time to assemble. I just start with laying out the pieces and I cut them to size if needed. And then glue them in place. I keep the flowers white so they pop out a bit.
I use the pre-made drops and if you don't know how to do that you can check out the video that I linked at the top. And here are my three artist trading coins. Now I told in another ACC video, if you don't like the trading part, you can also use them on a card. So I thought it would be a nice idea to show you just that. I call it a piece of watercolor paper, as you could see in the little time lapse. And I add some more color with some splats. And I spray some water so the color gets a bit softer. I want a light color for the background. Now after drying I'm going to assemble the card. And I add the tape following the circle. I use a 6mm tape. And this saves time adding little pieces and peeling off the backing. I add a yellow card to a white note card and I peel off the backing of the tape super easy. And then I add the coins to the card. I add the word smile and I finish with some more drops. So here's another way to use your coins, they're really fun to make, so do give it a try if you like. I hope you liked the video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe and make sure to keep on crafting!